Which Hollywood stars appeared in blackface and are now seemingly hiding it? Find out next. Welcome back to the channel. Derek Van Shake here. The point of this video is not to specifically demonize these Hollywood stars, but for you to decide for yourself if anything should happen to these stars who appeared in black makeup. A lot of this footage has been very difficult to find, since it seems that Hollywood has gone to great lengths to hide it from you, while they're also pretending that it never happened. But it did happen, and I'm revealing it all for you right now. Saturday Night Live seems to have tried really hard to hide the skits where they first used Fred Armisen to portray President Obama. When you look at my record, it's very clear what I've done so far. And that is... nothing. <laughs> what do you think about SNL using Fred Armisen in black makeup to impersonate and poke fun of our nation's first black president? Jimmy Kimmel appears as Carl Malone numerous times on The Man Show. Also, when you're watching these, remember it's more than just the makeup. It's also how they're portraying the individual while they're in black makeup. Sometime at night, Carl Malone look up in sky and say, what the hell going on up there? Do UFO live on other planet, phoning home like E.T.? Come along, read on TV about white people getting deducted by aliens. My body is my temple. That's why I start every morning with a brisk aerobic workout. But I can't do it alone. Workouts are easier when you have a partner. My workout partner is my maid, Marguerite. Marguerite's soft brown stomach protects my knees and ankles from unnecessary wear and tear. Not too much longer, me sopra, okay? Ah! That means shut up in Spanish. Jimmy Kimmel's Carl Malone and Oprah skits were not one-time occurrences. They were reoccurring on The Man Show. Do you think reappearing over and over in black makeup as that specific individual makes it worse? Joy Behar did black makeup in 1971, but in 2016, she speaks proudly of it. Watch. Is that you, Joy? Oh, you know, this picture. Oh, I was... Joy, is that you? Yes. Joy, that is oh, you? Yes. Oh, Joy, Wait. Wait. No, I know. <laughs> I Joy. was... Joy. I was so cute. <laughs> Joy, Joy. How cute I was. We... Are you my auntie, Joy? <laughs> no. It was a Halloween party. I went as a beautiful African woman. Oh, yeah, you ain't black. She seems absolutely clueless that it's offensive. Do you think Joy Behar dressing up as an African woman is less offensive now because it was done so long ago? Chris Rock said, uh, a lot of great shows this year. Jimmy Fallon verbally impersonates Chris Rock here in 2017 at the Golden Globe Awards, bringing back bad memories of his SNL skit in 2000, which was shocking to many and widely frowned upon. Watch. Rock, now we're talking. Where is he? Man, oh man, Rinders, I've seen who wants to be a millionaire, and guess what? Not a lot of black folks on the show. Not a lot of black folks on the show. You know why? Because black folks don't like to answer questions. Oh, they want to be millionaires. We got to ask that kind of question. Like, in 1981, how many grams of crack did Rick James smoke when he recorded Super Freak? <laughs> Regis, you think the only way to get a brother on the show is to name it, who wants $50 cash and a pair of Pumas? What do you think of Jimmy Fallon's shocking blackface appearance as Chris Rock? Sarah Silverman wears blackface on her show and somehow thinks she looks like Queen Latifah. I look like the beautiful Queen Latifah. She apologized for this scene years later, but do you think an apology makes a difference as opposed to the other actors who are apparently hiding the footage on the internet, avoiding questions on the topic, and pretending that it never happened? Billy Crystal appears as the late, great Sammy Davis Jr. in a recorded comedy sketch with Justin Bieber at the 2012 Academy Awards. So where are you going now? We're going to go hang out with Hemingway and Fitzgerald. And then we're going to go kill Hitler. <laughs> okay. More than you know. <laughs> Billy, is Beebs the young Sinatra or my nuts? Oh, Sammy, stop it. You my man. <laughs> this guy. Peace out. How did no one flag this when they were coming up with the idea and making the short? Do you think it's any worse because it happened not so long ago? Again, this is all for you to decide. Do you think these blackface occurrences should be brushed aside and forgotten like these Hollywood stars are seemingly trying to do? Do you think an apology would be acceptable? Or should their shows and appearances be canceled? Let everyone know what you think in the comments below. Remember to subscribe for more videos that always seem to shake up YouTube, and I'll see you at the top.